second national signing day for the upcoming 2019 class, and the Hokies add three players to the 19 they signed in December, including four-star offensive lineman Doug Nestor, who flipped from Ohio State. Quite frankly, when you look at the offensive class that's come in, it's not hard to figure out why we are becoming more attractive to these types of players. You look at what's happened here statistically over the last three years in terms of where those offenses have ranked, some with veteran players, some with young players, you know, where they've ranked in the, in the annals of Virginia Tech history, it's, it's, it's pretty impressive. Meanwhile, at Virginia, the building process continuing with Bronco Mendenhall. The Cavs already had 21 signed in December. Today, they had three more, including a grant in aid for a graduate transfer. 6'6", 311-pound offensive lineman from Penn State, Alex Gellerstedt. Uh, we had a need uh, for an offensive lineman uh, as a grad transfer, like we have every year. We filled that with Alex from Penn State. He, um, he has two years of eligibility remaining and is a very strong student, which is a perfect fit for UVA. And at Liberty, new head coach Hugh Freeze with his first Flames class signed 14 in December. Today added eight more in part two of this process. He didn't have much time, but says Liberty University was the selling point. My message was very simple to all the families in the short amount of time I had after the Christmas uh, break to, to try to convince kids in a short amount of time to, to join us was uh, come and see. And uh, the ones we were able to get on campus, uh, we, we, we batted a very high percentage. Indeed. Meanwhile, our local talent was busy signing on the dotted line for a quick tour around the area. We'll start in Blacksburg, where the Bruins had eight athletes moving on. Linebacker Drew Babcock to William & Mary, golfer Ben Carroll to Charleston Southern, soccer star Sam Dixon to Christopher Newport, Jacob Duncan is a golfer to Maryville College, linebacker Cole Epperly to Averett, Anna Kender, track and field star to Bucknell, Melody Scales will play volleyball at Xavier University, and Jacob Lucas will play tackle for Ferrum College. Hidden Valley had three student athletes signed today. Tackle Yasmir Blake and receiver cornerback Aaron Moore. Both signed letters of intent to play for Glenville State in West Virginia. Austin Thompson will head to play uh, Chris, for Christopher Newport University. Coach Weaver said this was a special signing class. They all three were captains. Um, they were seniors, they were four-year players and leaders. And those are, those are the kids that you want being the face of your program and giving the example to the younger kids that one day being up on that stage is possible. At the home of the Vikings, your former first and 10 player of the week, quarterback Jalen Jackson made it official, signing on to play for UVA Wise. He's a multi-sport athlete, passed for more than 1,800 yards, rushed for nearly 1,000 this past season, counting for 25 touchdowns. Three-time defending VIS State champ Rono Catholic signed a pair of Celtics today, including defensive lineman James Carpenter to JMU and teammate Alex Vaught, an all-state wide receiver, headed to Washington and Lee University. At Gretna, the Hawks inked wide receiver Dejon Hicks to Tyler Junior College in Tyler, Texas. He is one of quarterback Tabern Maben's favorite targets. Hicks heads to a football-rich program that moved players to D1 and beyond. I had a lot of offers, but I had some offers, but then they offered me a full scholarship and they like, they have put people in the NFL before, so I'm really excited to go. Other notables, uh, including our player of the year, Jabari Blake from Heritage, headed to Delaware State. A lot of schools represented here, including JF, William Campbell, GW, Danville, since Carl and Carlos pull both to Old Dominion. Trey Rice of Lord Botetot will kick for VMI. Rustburg sending an athlete to UVA Y.